Hey boos, you already know who it is. Best of the best perfect on my chest. S H Y N R I A. I'm back, you're back, and we're both to step back in two. So I mean, this is Welcome back if you are new. Welcome to my world. That can now be your world. As you can see from today's title, we're doing a sheen haul. I have collected sheen clothes for over since like 2020-ish. I'm just now filming, but from 2020 up until this year, 2022, I've shopped three big bowls of shopping carts, over $150 each cart. So I decided to finally film a sheen haul because I'm finally taking YouTube serious. So I decided to just accumulate all those three carts into one big video because it's a lot of clothes from sheen and they should sponsor me one day because it's a lot of clothes. So. It was actually three big bags, it was three big purchases, but my first purchase, I didn't think of that we have to film a video, so that, that bag is thrown away. So I kept these two bags, so I could do a thumbnail. And the clothes are now like folded up in the drawers and organized and stuff, but yeah. So in today's video, I'm going to do a try on haul. Well, it's not even a try on haul, because I've already, not, some clothes I haven't worn outside of my house, and some clothes I have worn outside, and some clothes I want to just put them on just to see how they fit. So it's more so like a lookbook, like I'm not just going to be putting the clothes on, I'm going to be making actual outfits for you guys. So I guess it's a sheen lookbook. So hopefully the lighting is good, it's the best lighting I can get because I ordered new light bulbs, they're supposed to be white light bulbs to match my white ring light. So I mean my white LED light so it can be bright in here, but they haven't come yet so we have to wait. But yeah, so I chose this setting because I love this quote. I feel like when you're putting on clothes, sometimes your mind can try to make you feel like you don't look good. So this quote here says, hello, looking absolutely stunning today. I purposely put it next to my mirror, so that way if I ever feel like ugh about myself, I see that quote right next to it, and it kind of just makes me feel better. I don't know, it's like a confidence thing. This also came from Sheen, so I'm saying it now to remind myself to put this link down there too. Every item, their shoes, purses and clothing all from Sheen. Everything's going to be down below so you too can get it in your size. Everything that I'm wearing is a medium or a large. I could do the extra work to tell you which one's a medium, which one's a large, or I could just keep going, but usually everything for me is a medium or a large. So yes, without further ado, we're going to get into it. This jumpsuit is not, or romper is not from Sheen. It is from another website. Um, she has inventory, it's not like Sheen, where it's always going to be there. Um, once she runs out of, or once she sells out of her inventory, she gets a new inventory, so this is no longer available anyway. These wonderful sandals are from Sheen. I can give you a close-up a little later. These are from Sheen. Um, the jewelry is not from Sheen, but the hoops are, if you can see them. They are from Sheen, just some small little hoops. It's like a 50 piece or 50 pairs, little pack of earrings. They were $2, so you go ahead and get some. These are press on nails, get into them. They are so cute. They look so good and so real. That's soon, that's soon, soon. But without further ado, we're gonna get into the haul. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe because I see Okay, so sorry, I did a little thing. This is the first outfit. Pretty simple, pretty cute. I've worn something similar to this one. I have I didn't wear these tights though. But everything's from Sheen, including the bag. And up close of the bag. Looks like that. It's really cute. All fur. You know, I'm really into tan these days. Like I love nude and tan color color clothes now. It's like one of my second. It's my second favorite color now for sure. But yeah, so this tank top, I like how stretchy it is. Like, it'll definitely be comfortable even for restricted in this tank top, as you can see. So she's not automatically fit you because it's so loose. So yeah, this is a large for sure. This was definitely under $2. I would not pay anything over $2 for a tank top, me personally. So yeah, really cute. I love the color. The material too is pretty smoothish. I love this bag because it's just so soft. And it's really, really pretty. So if you are like, you don't want to spend that much for a telfer bag, you have to just call it a tote. No, or this is a tote. This is either to mimic the 
tote for bag or a tote bag? I think it's the tote bag. Yeah, this is supposed to mimic the tote bag for Shein. This was like $17 or $18. I think this is a good price because it is so cute and so little and it's really deep on the inside. These tights say Hope. Babe, it says babe on the side in white. It's more like a almost leather type of material, kind of. But these also are shirty too, as you can see. Really form fitting. And then these sandals, I feel like they go with it because they're also tan. They match the bag more so than the shirt. This is more brownish, but it'll pass. So, yeah, this is the first outfit. Really cute. I love this outfit. I've worn something like this, but it was more so like tight material. It wasn't these exactly, but this is Sheen. Also, I wanted to make sure everything was Sheen when it came to my outfit. It, oh, excuse me. So, yeah, this was really, really cute. I've worn something similar to this and coming with the bag. Ooh. I'm so sorry. So the next outfit, that's what she said about this. Really cute but simple. Really cute, it's not too plain. But you know, definitely I wore this to like top golf, that type of event, and I wouldn't do too much. Okay, okay this is the next outfit. I haven't tried this shirt on since I bought it. I tried it on one time, and I think because I'm toning up because I am in the gym now. Yeah, it's a bit I'm in the gym now, so I think that's why it fits way better, but I think I was bloated at this point when I first bought it. It was really tight around this area, and now it's like, it's moving around me, so I like that, because I did not like this shirt when I got it. Okay, because, you know, I was on a smaller model, but I said, oh, well, if I wanted to buy it, and I bought it, and then when I got it, I said, oh. But if it's way better now, this, I feel like this is like when you're going to like an expensive restaurant, an expensive outing, like, I don't know, expensive restaurant was talking in my head, but like, one of the places where they cook the food in front of Yeah. That's what it's along with. It's really cute outing when walking the city when it's cold. Like, this is definitely a fall outfit, right? It's crop top, but it's mostly, I don't know, but I like it. And I think the ponytail towards the back makes it look better. Like, I don't want to put it right here. I like it towards the back. So I kept the bottom and the purse the same because it's also brown. So I have like two more shirts that are tan, so it's going to be the same bottoms because. I just feel like there's no other shoe. These are my only sheen shoes that I bought that are tan. I have the Yeezys, but I want everything to be sheen, like I said. So that's why the bottom for the rest of my tan clothes are going to be with this bag, these tights, and these sandals. This also, this is probably like $8. Mind you, if I have the prices wrong, you're still going to have the link at the bottom. So if I get it wrong, you still have the link to see for yourself. So it's okay. So yeah. So the thing with this jacket is it's a double jacket i mean a double zipper so it's kind of hard to take this bottom zipper off this one so this one moves this one also moves but i'm not gonna move because it was kind of hard when i first did get it to get it back in place so i just take this one off and i just take it off my head whether i take it off like a real jacket i just take it off over my head so i don't mess up this bottom zipper because it's hard to put the bottom zipper back intact. So yeah, so this is the look for it. Really cute. I like it a lot. I like it way more now than when I first got it. That's why I'm really surprised I'm feeling it because I was really, I got this, I put this one to her to take it off. But I really like it. So yeah, it definitely goes to my gold and stuff. Well, this is silver. Definitely goes to my necklace and stuff. So on to the next outfit. I told y'all I'm not lying. Um, hope oh, it's not a professional girl. But yeah, so this is the next outfit. Bottoms and purse the same. Let's get equipped. I love, 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 love this jacket. I've been trying to find this jacket. I'll have to go into photos to pull that receipt. Um, since 2019, 2020, one of those two years, I've been trying to find this jacket. And I finally found it last year. Towards the end of last year, and I got it. This was 17 or 18 dollars. But I was like, I'm buying this jacket. This is so cute. Like, I just like the half and half pattern. Like the half beige flannel print and the black and it just 
It looks so good. The cuffs also flannel. And it matches the bag really, really good. Um, as you can see, this is an exact outfit off of my Instagram, the first post on my Instagram. So, so I some outfits are worn outside and some outside. Some outfits are literally just sitting in my closet waiting. So this outfit did not wait. I've worn it twice so far out. The jacket once, because you know I live in Florida, so it's never that much of a need for a jacket. So I finally got to wear it around December, November ish. Whatever see the Instagram thing. What's the this year? But yeah, so this outfit, I love this outfit. It's just so cute and simple. It's just, but it's, but it's not that simple. It's a, not a lot going on with it. I don't know how to say it. It's simple, but it just says a lot. It just goes so well together, especially with my fur bag. This is the first time I ever got to wear my fur bag with this outfit. And it's just the cutest outfit ever. I love it so much. So definitely a fall outfit for sure. With the color, the look, the jacket. And I personally wear slides out in the winter and the fall seasoning. I don't really wear sneakers, slides, or crocs. That's it. So my feet don't get cold as much. They've adapted. But yeah, so this outfit's really cute. Go ahead and get this jacket. They also have it in reverse, I believe, where the beige is more so the out print and the black is like the half. Yeah, I think they have other prints of this jacket too, but I have to get this one. This one is just so cute. And I think the the girl that I saw with it on a couple years ago had this jacket, so that's why I really wanted this jacket because that's made me fall in love with the jacket. How it looks, my son. I think so. So yeah. Sisters, also backstory about this purse. I was not going to get this all brown beige purse. It had this. It's like the brand. This part was going to stay the tan color, but the fur was white. And when I finally went to buy it, the white one was sold out, but this one was still available. So I just sucked it up and I was like, I need to have this purse. So I did get this purse and I fell in love with it. And now I still want to go and get the white one because I originally wanted the white one. And the white one still looks pretty, really, really cute. So when you click the link, you'll see the white option for this purse too. So a shop at your leisure. I think that's the word. So yeah, this one is pretty cute. In the pony, I will put it in front. And pony by this now, on to the next outfit. Okay, so this outfit, I'm not, I don't really care for this shirt. When I bought it, I bought it as just a shirt to have that wasn't crop tops. I have a lot of crop tops and not enough out simple shirts. So I just bought the shirt simple, but because it was simple. But I don't like how, like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't like how loose it is at the bottom. It just makes me really boxy. I'm not that boxy. So yeah, but this bag is from Sheen. This is my first ever Sheen purse. Something in French. I forgot. I always forget what it says in French. But it's like welcome to something like that. So yeah, this is my first ever bag off Sheen. I think it was seven or eight dollars. I don't know. I could get some prices. But yeah. So this purse because it has some gold on it, so it can match the necklace. Clear, almost whitish clear, so it matches the shirt. These slides were my first ever slides off Sheen. Close up. They're Louis print. They're very old. They're 2020, so. But yeah. So definitely wear these because these are also clear. As you can see, so this nice purse too. See the themes. I'm trying to go for themes. Then the white on the side of the. On the side of the pants. So this outfit is a really basic outfit. Too much to it. This is like the going to the mall fit or something. I don't know, but it's not too special to this outfit. So now we're into the white shirt that I got. Bought or purchase, I should say. This shirt is something too fancy. It's kind of cute. It underlines the boob. See, my boobs are not the smallest, so it doesn't even underline it. Whatever. But it also goes along with the bag and the slides. And these tights are definitely coming in handy right now, as you can see. But yeah, so this is a cute outfit. This is like a brunch, like a Sunday outfit. Like today is Sunday, August 20th, 29th. Today is the 29th. August 29th, 2022, it's a Sunday. Netflix is a Sunday outfit. Don't know where on Sunday, but it's really cute. Like, I see this little brunch with the girls. 
Do y'all agree? Comment down below. Red heart, if you think this is a, no, yellow heart, if you think this is a burnt outfit, thumbs down in the comments if you don't think this is a burnt outfit. I personally will wear this to get some sunny D um, juices, breakfast with my friends. Okay, right. But yeah, so this outfit is really cute. I love it. It gets really girly. I don't know, like it's simple girly. I feel really cute and light in this outfit. Like, light like a feather. Fly, fly away. So yes, this outfit's pretty cute. Love it. I had to, this shirt has grown me when I got it. I was like, what is this? And then I just started like, oh, it's cute. And I think, I think hairstyles to turn out cute. Um, a shirt or outfit can be like, sometimes you have the wrong hairstyle and outfit's cute, or your hair cute, but the outfit is not matching. I personally think that Excuse me, there's a lot of outfits that I've worn with like braids or slip backs and we're gonna see how I like it with the ponytail. I don't know, each hairstyle gives you a new person. And I just noticed before I started the camera back that my frame was tilted, so hopefully it wasn't tilted for too long because that would bother me if I was watching the videos hopefully it was. I sincerely apologize, but I did fix it. Okay, so on to the next outfit. Oh, and it matches my nails too. Let's talk about it. On to the next one. Here is another outfit or another shirt that I don't care for, but now that I'm looking at it with this outfit, it's not that bad. Oh, that is cute. Oh, it's cute. I didn't like it at first. I think I had it with the wrong pants, maybe. I don't know what I paired it with the first time, but I didn't like it. I still like the way it like, the bottom is just really awkward. Like it's loose and then like, it's a little uneven because I have my bag on, so it's hard to wear a purse with it. So I don't know, the bottom is weird. I don't like how high the neckline is. I like more of like a, not too plunging, but just a U-shaped or V-shaped. No U-shaped. Um, neckline, this one's like around the neck. So I don't know how it is because sometimes it tucks my necklaces depending on which necklace it is. But I guess with this outfit it works. I purposely put on this bracelet because it's a lot of red going on in here. So I put this bracelet on and it matches. I'm gonna hold my hand up as you can see. So yeah, I'm really, yeah. I'm really, I love outfits. I like matching. I I like pairing stuff up, but it's up close on the bracelet. This is from They Love Tea Charms. I'm trying to spray this up. Okay, there you go. So that is, yes, my face on a charm, on a bracelet. And it's a Gucci sign with a red tassel, and that's why I put it with the shirt, because really the tassel and the Gucci kind of would go up the shirt. So this is probably the one time where I get to wear my, um, Face bangle, I guess you can say. But I love it so much to have my face on a bracelet. Like it's been me for real. Thank you. So yeah, so they love tea charms is where I got this. I believe it's like 10 to 16. I don't know how much. 10, I think 16 after check. I think don't hold me to it, but that's the website and Instagram if you want to go. So yeah, that's this outfit. On to the next one. Here's our next shirt. I had this shirt for a little minute as well. I think I got it on last year. Yeah, last year, 2021. This is my second big purchase from Shoe. Um, this shirt's pretty cute. Pretty self-explanatory. Um, well, not really, I guess. It's not a shirt. It's kind of like a jacket. It opens like that. The strings is what brings it together. So as you can see, I put a little bow. It. If you look at the model, if you want the shirt, you can see it's on a ladder-chested young girl or young woman. So I'm not flat chested, so um, it's really like a no bra type of shirt and you don't, and these don't really have to be as close together. But I have on a bra because I am not flat chested, so I don't know, so I don't look like an idiot. I have it tied a little bit closer and I always want to see how this look my belly ring, but every time I take it out and it closes up. I remember once the belly ring hole is closed, or the piercing hole is closed, that I have this shirt. But yeah, so it's really open shirt. If I didn't care, I would show you how to tie it, but um, I do care. So yeah, just um, 
Just so that when, if I pull the string, the shirt is gonna come off like that. And when I put it on, it'll just be separated and I have to tie it. So yeah, this is a pretty basic shirt. I don't, I think a Sunday outfit, this is too, maybe to the movies. Something really simple for this. This purse, because my other two purses, I haven't seen that purse yet, but it's coming. They wouldn't go with this, of course, you know, it's crazy about put these on. So yeah, on to another outfit. All right, on to our next shirt, next outfit, I guess. Um, we're still keeping this area the same because this is green. I usually do bring Crocs, but like I said, sheen videos, so we're gonna keep everything sheen. So I would wear it with these, with this. If I was trying to be all sheen down, I would do it with these. I have more selection. I'll let y'all see. I can do a slide collection for y'all. I have 28 pairs of slides. So I can definitely give y'all a little haul bag. A toe wear. But yeah, so sheen only. So that's why we're going to keep with this bag. These shoes and these tights. I love this shirt. It had to grow on me. I was a bloated. When I bought this shirt, I was around 183 pounds. I'm now 173 pounds. So a year later, 10 pounds down. Um, so yeah, so definitely the smaller I get, the more form fitting it's gonna feel. But if I showed you how it looked when I first got this shirt, you can see why I was insecure about wearing this shirt. But it's definitely growing on me the more I'm toning up my stomach area. Even my arms, like it was like really tight around my arms. And now look like, there's some flat and it's like, some looseness going on. And I now am gonna look at this shirt specifically a year ago. Cause I remember this part, it was like choking my arm. Like, this is a large, so. This is when I realized that sheen clothes, like sometimes it could be large, but it's gonna fit like a small. Like, so that's why sometimes I do size up a lot of the times. Like a lot of my crop tops are larges and I could have got them in a medium, but from this shirt, I was always nervous that it was gonna be too tight, especially it was a tank top. Actually, this is when I, before I got comfortable in tank tops and I ordered a bunch of tank tops to get comfortable in tank tops, I went to play safe and I got a large, so I'd have room. But I could've got a medium play it. So that's some, that's some good, that's some good results right there a year later. I've worn this shirt since I made some TikToks in it in March of last year. So it's pretty cool to see some results in it. And here too, it's more, moves a little bit, you see it's stuck on me. It's pretty cute, I'll wear with this. I probably would do plain tights that are not sheeny, but I would do some plain tights that I have because it's black and I feel like this throws it off. The white, that's just me though. But yeah, so I like this outfit. I like the shirt, I should say, really, really cute. Okay, little check-in. How are we doing? Are we doing good? Are we sitting through the video? Are we liking these outfits? Because I'm actually liking them. I personally, one of my hobbies, it's a hobby, uh, is like plain dress up. Like I always, if I ever feel down or I just get in the mood where I just wanna put clothes on, I just come in the room, play music. There's music in the background, I don't know if you can hear it. I did do a test on and the music was like low, low, low from the playback, so I don't think you'll be able to hear it because I do put like instrumentals throughout my video, so there's some type of music, but um, I didn't want it to like, I don't want the audio to sound weird with my music being loud and the instrumentals music. So I don't think you hear the music, but I have music playing right now. So yeah, if you follow me on TikTok, you've seen this um, top before. All my tan tops you've seen also if you follow my TikTok or seen it. This is really cute. I like this uh, TikTok, it's loose. It's cute, so I don't have to worry about it. Like my body's too tight, I'm feeling all self-conscious, really loose, as you can see. This is the third purse that I have on Shein so far. I have, my wish list is filled with a whole bunch of purses that I want to get into. Like, I'm slowly but surely getting into purses and collecting them and having a variety. But this is my second purse that I bought. The first one was the clear one. This is the second purse that I bought on Shein and my tan bag is my most recent purchase of a purse from Shein. But up close, I'm into butterflies. So it's some butterflies on here, some chains going on. Really cute and it's a really small purse. And it just fits so well with this shirt. Usually um, when I do wear this, tank top in this purse out. I do it with my lavender crocs because it's just like all lavender theme. Lavender is my favorite color so I try to, when I wear lavender, I try to lavender it out. So yeah, so I love this purse with it. It just looks so cute, it just matches so well. I definitely like this hairstyle with it. I just would curl the ends so I can like curl and do like that bougie, classy look if I curl the ends of the ponytail. 
So yeah, so this is that. Really cute. Really cute. Okay, next to the, um, in these next outfits, we're moving out of these tights and we'll be in some shorts that are not shaded. But the shirts that I'm gonna try, the, sh the shirts that I'm gonna put on for the lookbook are gonna have to require those shorts. So they're not sheen. I mean, you probably find some on sheen, but I'm not gonna link them because they're not sheen shorts. But in order for me to really wear the shirt and give you a lookbook, I have to put these shorts on. So be mindful of that. So this is the next outfit. Oh, let me get the necklace. I have it with my lavender purse, but they're two different lavenders. This is more of an orchid purple. This is a lavender purple. So the purse does not match well with this. So let's switch it out. Let me see how this will look. Neither. Okay, so we're not doing the purse for this outfit. There's probably better purse in the world, but it's not. My ring light is sitting on my bed so I can get good lighting. Yeah. We gotta do what we gotta do. Okay, so this is no purse, sadly. Feel really weird without the purse on. Yeah, this shirt is way longer. I got it in a small, this is a small. And it fits like an extra large. I don't know, even sure. It looks like Sheen took a dad shirt, t shirt, and just went crazy with it. Even look at the sleeve. Like, I don't like this shirt at all. It's way longer as you can see. I have my sister cut it so it would be like a towel on me because I am five feet flat. So this shirt was like right here. It's just, it was a lot with this shirt. So I had her cut it so it could be somewhat more shorter and it's still very long. I don't really wear this shirt out a lot. One time I wear this shirt, if I'm like loaded on my menstrual and, we're going, and I'm going out somewhere, then I put this shirt on. But I don't really like this shirt. So I put it with these slides, of course. These shorts are from another website, another clothing website. This is also like the jumpsuit, two different websites also, but it's also like the website I was telling you about, the clothing brand. Once they run out of inventory, they get new inventory. They don't restock, they just do new inventory. So this is it, it's a two piece that goes with this. Yeah, so I'll wear these shorts since it's so long of a t-shirt. Next outfit. Okay, so I know I said no um, outside brands, but um, personally, I have to wear my Crocs with the shirt. It just goes too well together. I went on a girls trip and I put this this exact outfit on with the purse because it matches the lavender on this side. So went and the up close of these Crocs, it's the you know the basic tie dye Crocs, but a little something. My freaking face is on them. Who's really doing it like me? I don't know nobody. This is a gibbet crock charm with my face on it. I'm not seeing it be done. So yeah, love these. These are off the charm. It's also from the little tea charm. So if you could be like me, you know, here. Just, just give my credit. Just give my credit. But yeah, so this is this is this outfit. Really cute. I personally like this shirt with braids or like a high bun. No, slip back. Let me put a Snapchat clip right here of it with a slip back. It's like going down the valley. I love this shirt, this outfit with a slip back. Claw clip hairstyle. We yeah, the punter will do those punters on the back. Mm. So like I said, some uh, a hairstyle makes a shirt. This outfit is just not it with a ponytail. But Slip back for sure. I love this shirt so much. So cute, so different. Definitely around Easter time is when I got it, and it definitely fits the Easter theme. Like, if I was at an Easter party, Easter brunch, Easter egg hunt, I'll wear this outfit down to the toe. So, hopefully, you guys like it too. Let me know in the comments how these outfits are doing so far because I personally think I'm doing it for real. Like, I definitely think I'm being inspiration right now. So, I have one more shirt with shorts on. And then we'll get into jeans, two rompers, a two-piece, and that's it. I believe. I believe. I believe. Okay, so this is the next outfit. Pretty simple. I've worn this multiple times twice. Twice so far. Really, really cute. I love this outfit. Going out with my friends. This is also an outfit I've worn to my to a top golf. Um, 
date night with my friends. Or not date night, what else am I doing going out with my friends? I've worn this. I didn't wear these slides. I wore some other slides, but we're doing all sheen. So that's my abilities. So really cute shirt, really simple. Um, I also got this in small and it's pretty big. It's not as big as that purple t-shirt. It cuffs way better, fits way better. I like how formal it is, not formal, I like how loose it is. I love the butterflies. I love, love, love butterflies. So I love all the butterflies on it. I love the brown, it goes well with the gold and the silver. So yeah, really cute outfit. Love wearing this outfit a lot. So yeah, on to, let's see, do you guys want jeans, rompers, or the jump piece first? I want the rompers? Okay, we can do the rompers. Let's go into the rompers. Next outfit. I know I said rompers. But, um, I, I wanted to get some shorts out the way. I forgot I had these shorts. So, this is a very, very basic outfit. Uh, I wore this outfit. Just has something very, very loose on. Um, a little backstory. When I was paranoid of sheen clothes being too tight, I got these in an extra large. Because I was so nervous these shorts were going to be too tight. I just got an extra one. I was not thinking. And when I got them, they fit like boxing shorts. Like just super flabby. I don't like how all of this right here is super. Like, there's literally nothing here. Literally nothing here. So I want to reorder really these actually and get like a small. Because they're so loose. Small, maybe a medium. Probably a medium. But the back does say, let's say California, I think. So the back is what really makes these shorts because the design is on the back. But they're pretty cute. So yes, yeah, so when you order these shorts, either get your regular size or size down. Because these are just plenty, plenty of room in these shorts. Do not go two sizes up like I did. Don't. We yeah, have really basic outfits. Now I'm gonna give you guys my first like you just said. And I did this purse because I don't know, just the gold kind of made some like it would mesh well with this outfit. Yeah. I haven't worn this one also in a year. Uh, you can see the hourglass. It looks better when you're at my eye level a little better. Um, this is a strapless, but I do have one bra. This is a strapless romper. It says baby girl on it in white. Definitely matches my nails. Really cute. Paired with this purse because you know, just the white clear. Just Self-explanatory. These slides, for sure. Really cute, really basic outfit. This is a night of bowling. Maybe with a jacket, but yeah, bowling for sure. I see this outfit. So yeah, on to the next romper. It's very similar, but the design is what makes it different. But yeah, it's a really basic outfit. Not much to say about this. Just too basic to really say anything. Does fit well though. It's, it's a really good shirt. I'll say that's really good shirt to wear. But you'll still see your figure in it, so that's a good thing. So here's the second one. Like I said, the design is what makes it different. This one is a soft lizard. The dragon, the light made a dragon on the window. I mean the wall. But yeah, this one really cute, really simple. It's almost the same, but the print right here makes it very different. It's a dragon. I went through like love the dragon phase for like a couple months. I even bought a dragon phone case off Sheen because I just love dragons. And but I grew out of it like after like two months. Wait, yeah, this right here says. What was that? Luck Fairy. Because I think Drake. I don't know. If I put the points in the back, really cute. Just like the little sideburns be out. So yeah, nothing much to this one either. I probably wouldn't do this purse. I really see this outfit because I was looking in the mirror. I see this as a cookout. Like, you're about to say we're going to be his family for the first time. And you don't know what to wear, and you're doing a cookout. I'll wear this. <laughs> but I think this would be a good outfit. What do y'all think? I see this for a cookout, me personally. Yeah, I wouldn't do it with this bag, though. But hell, it doesn't really bring anything to the table with this bag. But yeah. So now we have one two piece, two piece set, and the next of the outfits will be in jeans. So here we are with the jumpsuit, the one only jumpsuit that I've gotten off Sheen so far. This was like $11, no, did I get this for nine? I don't remember, but this one was a very affordable jumpsuit. I get lots of compliments on this on TikTok. I have not worn this out of the house yet because you know, I was always 
was nervous, but I'm finally getting into the comfortness of my body wearing out in public. But yeah, I got a lot of companies on TikTok for this one. Or you that seen it on TikTok has told me that it's pretty. So I love it too personally, like the brown. This um two-piece. This is a two-piece jumpsuit. I don't know what to say, but this two-piece has multiple colors. There's black, there's white, there's more of a tannish color. This is brown. There's green, there's blue. There's a lot in this cup. This set comes in. So whichever one you prefer. I'll show you this one. Go with. Okay, so yeah. So I wore these slides. Personally, if I was going out, out, I wouldn't wear these slides. But for the video, I'm gonna wear these slides. I put this purse with it, but I probably wouldn't do a purse. I probably would do this first, but it wouldn't be too, for any specialness. I put my ring on. I just realized through this whole video, I did not have it on. But I love having my nails done and having rings on. Without my nails done, I don't wear rings. I just don't feel it as much. But when I have my nails done, yeah. It's so cute. I have this, I've had this ring since 2018. And I can't get it in person. It's like really cute. Love it. I like it like this. So now the rest of these outfits, I think it's like five left. I don't know, so you know, stay strong. I still feel really good, like I don't feel tired or anything. Maybe because it's like three something, I think. 3 p.m. Um, so yeah, so I got like five outfits, I think. The rest are shirts with one pair of jeans, and then there's another pair of jeans that I have to wear. Oh, yeah, so it's two pair of jeans that are from Shein left, and then there's a bulk of shirts left that are gonna be with one pair, one specific pair of jeans, and then the other pair of jeans is gonna be with one shirt. Whatever. And that's probably gonna be last because it's my favorite pair of jeans that I have. So that one's gonna be last. So let's keep rolling. So here is the next outfit. Now we are in jeans. Really cute. Usually, I don't know what happened from last night tonight. Usually, um, button jeans I have the top button undone while the zipper is still up because jeans usually give me like a little muffin top. I mean, you can still see it, but. Usually when I'm still be sitting. So I don't know what changed from last night. You know, I did go to the gym. So I don't know what changed me. So this I love, 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 love this top. It's so cute. Give you an up close of it. It's so cute. Get some blue, some neon yellow, some pink. Just tie-dye. I just I love this shirt. It just meshes so well. And with it, I did choose this first, just because out of the three purses, this one's the closest to it. Um, so yeah, I love, love, love this. I like, I worn this with tights, but I personally think this shirt belongs with jeans. So that's why I put it with the jeans side of this video. So really cute, this shirt is so cute. Um, this shirt is a large. It is a little skin tight. Like it will cuff your stomach. So just be aware of that depending on how um, comfortable you are with tight clothing. Whatever size, whatever, if it is true to size. In a way. So yeah, I love, love, love this shirt. So, yeah, but I haven't worn out I haven't worn it outside the house yet. Waiting for the right moment. But yeah. Love this shirt so much. Okay, now we're gonna go into another shirt with jeans. These jeans. So here is here is the next outfit. Um this outfit I had a specific inspiration. Personally, I got this from Samira Tussie's girlfriend. I seen this outfit on one of her like fan page closets, like you know, people make closets of her clothing, of her outfits, and they put like the links and stuff like that. So I had a specific inspiration for this outfit. I'm gonna put it right here. Probably put this way better because it's it's the original thought. I am you know the duplicate. Okay. For one, I wanted a longer romper like the one she had on, but I could not find one on Sheen that was longer. This is the longest that I personally could find. You found one? But I did keep the color. I like the color that she had. Um, I like the idea of like the little student collar shirt. Work with these jeans, of course, paired it with the new slides and the new bag. Really cute. This is also like a fall outfit. With these jeans, I like this with jeans for sure. You can also wear this shirt without. Looks really cute without um, this jacket, but if it was a little chilly, you could definitely still do this outfit with this type of flannel jacket material. Okay. So now we are moving on to our last, last piece 
hopefully you have been enjoying these outfits i have been enjoying putting them together i've like put them together a thousand times just haven't recorded them or worn them outside the house um besides my nude outfits my new color shirts have been outside the house and every other piece have stayed in this exact room so hopefully you are finding some outfit inspirations like Please tell me if you're feeling these outfits because I personally love dressing myself up and putting myself together because it's just so fun putting on clothes and stuff. I know, I love it. So hopefully you are enjoying this video as much as I'm enjoying filming it. I am not tired at all as I'm putting on these clothes to take them off because literally it had to be the devil. Because I was eating before I filmed, of course, and as I was eating, I was like, dang, I'm going to put these clothes on and off, on and off. Like, this going to be tiring and I'm going to get bored. I feel great. And I almost psyched myself out and wasn't gonna film. Then it started raining outside. You heard that at the beginning, yeah, that was raining. And I was like, oh, it's raining. I, I was like, the lighting isn't gonna be good in my room. We're doing it for real. Thank you. My, yeah, look at my other outfit. We'll talk in the end. The last, last, last outfit. Can you see? Hopefully you can. I am obsessed with these jeans. They are butterflies all over. Can you see? Let's stretch them. They're butterflies at the top and they're like that poofy. I forgot the exact wording for it, but the puffed out jean. Um, it puffs out at the at the foot. Those type of jean prints. So yeah, I love it. I have it paired with. I have it paired with this black tank top because for the longest I could not find anything to pair with. I finally, in this moment, figured out this tank top would match. Before I have a pink, I have a blue, um, a blue two-piece set, and it's like how the brown, brown two-piece set looks. It's a blue one, not from Shein though. And I used to put it on with that, and it really didn't work, but it worked. But black for sure. And I put it with this bag because it's all Shein. I would do it with this bag. I did it with these slides. I probably would do it with these slides for what I really was wearing this outfit. But I am very satisfied with this outfit. Before, like these jeans, I can tell I'm slimming up for sure in my abdomen area, stomach area, because these jeans, no matter what, unless I wore my um waist trainer, it would always give me a muffin top look. Now I do have my stomach sitting, but I could bring it out too. It doesn't really matter, but I kind of liked it up here. I usually don't like jeans like that, but because of how long these pants are, I just want them to fully stretch. Because you can definitely tell these are made for a tall, current tall girl because they literally are at my foot for real. But yeah, these are so cute. I love these jeans because it's so hard to match them and they're butterflies and they're different. I love, 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 love these jeans. And now that I finally made an outfit, I'm excited to wear this. Probably my next outing with my friends, this outfit will get packed for sure. So yeah, this is the last outfit of my huge Sheen haul collection haul lookbook. Don't know what I'm titling it yet. You're gonna know, but I don't know yet. I think lookbook Sheen is gonna be in there. Huge Sheen lookbook. Huge Sheen lookbook haul. That sounds good, I think. So yeah, um, if you haven't already viewed my first video back on YouTube, decorate my first car with me, the interior. You're gonna love it. In that video, I have all my interior down in the link below, down in the description, every link. And in this video, every clothing item, every purse, the hoop earrings, this um, banner room accessory is gonna also be in the description. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications if you're willing. Wait for more videos to upload. My first video is about to hit 200 views, which is very, very exciting. So keep subscribing, keep viewing. Yeah, thank you. I don't know if I have my tattoo in my first video, did I? I don't know if I have my tattoo in my first video. I don't think I had this tattoo. I had my foot tattoo, but I don't think this tattoo is in that video. So. My newest piece, I had it done in July, so that's why I don't know. That video was sitting in my dress for a minute. But anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed these outfits. If you want more hauls and more lookbooks, just let me know. Because like I told y'all, I love putting outfits together and trying to close on. That's definitely one of my favorite hobbies. So without further ado, this video is at a complete end. I think I ended with a bang. I think I, I, think I gave some pretty good looks. So yes, so 
like I said, I keep feeling myself. I'm so sorry. I'm just so excited. So yes, I'll see you in the next video. Whatever my heart desires that I feel you would love to see, you will see it. And then stay blessed, stay happy, and I will see you in the next video.